But what we wanted to do, a plan for a new direction. We want to be upfront with the American public. We want an election to have a contrast. GOP leaders unveiled a new agenda for Republicans to unite behind ahead of the midterm elections. Called the Commitment to America, the plan outlines four areas where Republicans say they can do a better job than Democrats in leading. House Republican leader Kevin McCarthy spearheaded the rollout. He highlighted how the cost of living has gone up under Democrats and how a range of other problems have gotten worse as well. You know what's even worse? The country's struggle goes beyond just the grocery store. Violent crime is at record highs in our streets and neighborhoods. The border has become a national security crisis, with fentanyl killing our fellow citizens. A similar effort by Republican Senator Rick Scott to put out a party agenda stirred up controversy earlier this year. Senate Republican leader Mitch McConnell had opposed parts of the plan, such as raising taxes on lower-income Americans, and he had feuded openly with Scott about the effort. But McConnell publicly supported McCarthy's new plan, writing on Twitter that McCarthy would, quote, bring the people's priorities back to the people's house. Democrats were quick to criticize the plan, especially language that suggests the Republicans would pursue abortion bans if given the House majority. Democrats also pushed back on proposals that would take aim at a drug pricing bill they celebrated earlier this year. But Republicans are hoping a proactive agenda can help them defeat Democrats in November by giving them things to say they are for instead of just campaigning on what they're against. Sarah Westwood for The Washington Examiner.